All right, here's my bike. I exercised my Husky with it, and most of the dog rigs I thought were terrible. Uh, I got a bit of mechanical background. I designed my own. There's already a mount here, already attached to the handlebars of the bike. It's all aluminum, so it's super lightweight. This here is the rig, uh, the armature, and it has a guide loop here, a guide support tube here, and a second guide loop here. This is where the arm articulates so the dog can go on either side of the bike or in front and this is what attaches it to the bike. It's just a quick connect. Through it goes and it's connected. It can go up and down right now. It can move fully from side to side. And this is where I control from the center how much my dog gets or doesn't get. And if I want it really tight, I just hook it over the bottom bracket, and it goes nice and snug. And it's tight. It goes to the side of the handlebar and back. It doesn't go beyond the handlebar. There's a stop on each side preventing it from going back. And it gives you more than ample room in here for your handlebar, for your brake, for your shifter. It's not going to get in the way. And at any point you feel your dog's going to be pulling you or, or maybe pulling you down, you just let off here and it's going to easily come out of the rig. Whoops. And that's it. That's all there really is to it. It's, it's, uh, it's pretty simple. It's sturdy. It's lightweight. It is all aluminum. And that's my dog rig.